Welcome back to Let's Play Super Paper Mario. And, yes, the mysterious Mr. L. We remember being, well, mystified by that title. Maybe. Kind of depends on whether you played the game before. We're here, Squeagle. This is the Woe Zone. It exists! Tippy. Okay, you owe him one. The Woe Zone exists. And the shortcut did get us here. He was not leading us into a trap. Well, maybe the Woe Zone is a trap, so we don't really know it yet. Squirps can't wait. Squirps is gonna spray on ahead. This is a super complicated maze, but this one is fun. Because we're not swimming around in space. Can't believe that creature left us at a time like this. I do feel the presence of the pure heart. <coughs> so even if Squirps was leading us into a trap, at least, you know, we beat whatever boss it is and get the pure heart. So this place is just crazy cool. And now you get why I kind of get this place confused with the last one. Because it is kind of high-tech, but it's high-tech in a different way. I also get the music of this place confused with the music of the Cross Knot Fortress from Thousand Year Door. It sounds kind of alike. But kind of different. Okay, let's check out these guys. That's a Tyloid R. It's a mysterious creature that's made of many small parts. Mass HP is 15, attack is 2. Can also crawl along walls and ceilings. Tyloid's wary and color and ability. The red Tyloid is known for its high HP. Yeah, that's a question block. That's a Tyloid Y, and it's known for its great speed. So this one's got higher HP. But, let's, uh, let's kill two Tyloids with one attack. With one throw. This, this place is cool. It's not my favorite chapter in the game, but actually it is pretty high up there. But it's not my number one favorite. My number one favorite still coming up. Is it? No, wasn't it chapter 2-4? I don't really... I just remember... I just realized I don't really have a favorite. I mean, there are some I like that are coming up. And there might be something like here. Yeah, I remember that. And don't forget, that's how we got in there. We get another slow flower. Don't forget, you can always use Fleet to stun these quick enemies. Okay, this is the enemy that I thought might have been in Fort Francis. Basically, when you stomp on it, it takes three hits. It doesn't have HP, it just has hits. And, um, okay, we need Peach to get across here. When you stomp on it once, then, um, yeah, you need to go into 3D to get around this, I think. And I'm right. What was I going to say? Yeah, basically, whenever you stomp on it, it gets smaller and faster. There, are, I think there's another enemy that's like that. Or maybe it's just that one I'm thinking of. So basically, you got to go a little off track just to get that. So that's kind of something that could trip you up. Something that they usually save for Zelda dungeons. But no. This is hardcore, man. And yes, we will be going upside down. So it's Super Mario Galaxy... Uh, few months early. This game came out in the same year as Galaxy, but just a little bit before. Since it's 2D, it really kind of reminds me of a Gravity Man from Mega Man 5. And as you can see, this big guy doesn't slow down or speed at all. I forget what these guys are called. That bizarre beat says, oh yeah, pig rhythm Everything about it is just odd. But each stomp makes it smaller and faster. Yes. But Pigorhythms actually have a lot of... They drop a lot of coins. The easiest way to beat them is with Bowser's Fire Breath. Because you can deal with the quick one as well. Well, that is if you can see it. You got no chance. And we actually don't get to be Bowser for very long. We gotta go up these stairs here. Yeah, our HP's running kind of low because this is 
The game's starting to get tough. <laughs> yeah, pig rhythms are kind of cool. Unfortunately, enemies just like just like you do stuff get the uh, post hit invincibility. Okay, let's uh, we, we got a lot of healing items. So let's use one right now. Um, how about you know we don't quite have, need enough for that. So how about a fried egg? You know because we, we know Bowser loves fried eggs, right? Hey, I said I was gonna let Bowser eat the fried egg, and it just worked out like that. So now we start to get to go upside down. You actually have to hold up to do the fire breath. And, you know, right, right is still right and left is still left. But you do have to hold down to open doors and up to do the fire breath and that stuff. So don't look at it upside down or else you'll be doing it the opposite way. And now is where the, I think it starts to get real with fun. Right here. Did we use the dimension key yet? No, yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah, we did. Oh, uh, we need Peach for a short while, just to get her over here. But we might want to use Peach once in a while, just to, you know, protect from those pigarisms and such things. Oh, that's right, you gotta hold right in order to do the invincibility thing. You gotta hold right, of course. Uh, yeah, we can't get up there quite yet. Oh god, this is trippy. Ah, uh, she's falling. So that's the door where we started, but... Now we're going here, and we're right side up for a change. But we won't be for very long. There's a pipe behind here. And as you can see, that's a locked door behind there, so we got to find something before we can go there. And yes, we're upside down. Make sure to go into 3D. Well, sometimes it doesn't maximize your range, but it doesn't hurt to check. Okay, wait a minute, but what do you do now? I mean, there does not look like there's any more fire. Nope. Looks like that's all there is to this room. Up oh, to go on the pipe. I mean, that happens, but usually not when you're standing on it like that. Uh, there's something up there, but... You know... So yes, there is another way in here, and that's probably how you get the key. That, I think that's a key, but... There's probably, more than likely, there's another way out of this room. I mean, there are, de there are definitely other doors, but... Yeah, there's this door right here, but that one just takes you back over there. So, there really isn't another way out of this room. Wait, no! There, there's another one over there. Wait a minute. Why don't we use Peach? Why don't we use Peach again? But wasn't this the first time? Wait a minute. Where does this go? This goes somewhere totally different, right? Yeah, okay. I really don't understand how this is how I didn't how I missed this last time, but okay, I'm here now. Oh man. We're down to eight again? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Now this room, it's actually possible to get yourself stuck in, I think. But... Yeah, you gotta go this way. Then you use that and you turn it upside down. But if you... Yeah, so you can use that and turn it upside down. But if you go back in the 3D and go over there, then I'm pretty sure you're stuck. And yes, that happened to me once, so... Maybe you're not stuck. God. Whew. Okay, let's let's heal up again. We have a lot. I wonder how long we're gonna be able to say that though. Let's have some inky soup. I'm trying to eat all the cooked items first. Oh my! I'm just being careless. 
I'm being careless, that's all there is to it. You got a lot of health, you slack off. So how about I start being more strategic? And uh, you might not know what to do here, but if you actually recognize it, this is the same room that we entered and got the first key, the one where you had to do the 3D. And if you remember, there was one right here. So it's very important that you remember that. And, you know, be able to recognize your surroundings. And now we're here, and we can get this key. Now, I wish they could just drop you down here. Or there's some kind of... Or, like, there's some kind of pipe to drop you down. Or some kind of one-way trip. Or two-way trip would be fine. Well, since it's near the end of the video, let's just say that Mario has the power to drop down. And, you know, I want to actually try something. Can Mario jump in that pipe from here? Come on, he should be able to. I mean, what's a, what's a good reason why he shouldn't be able to? Yeah, you can't actually jump. You cannot actually jump higher here. Okay, see you guys later. Bye.